What's good? Let's get it. You know, let's watch this video of a guy called her girlfriend cheating real quick. And now she's going. Stop recording me, you dick! I haven't done anything wrong. So Kitty invited me over and saw that she invited me over and now she's going crazy. I'm leaving. Give me my stuff! What's wrong with your room? I didn't take any of it. You're... No. Don't take my I'm leaving. I don't want to leave you. She is, she is going crazy. She is really going crazy. She, she doesn't know what to do. Her emotion, she's completely out of control. And as I've seen until this moment, the man is calm. He's cool. Like, I'm actually proud of that man. You know? She's all around have zero control invited another boy over while she has a boyfriend and she got caught and now she's completely freaking out she got zero control but the man though the guy he's taking it real cool let's keep it going though stop what i'm leaving I'm leaving. Why can't I leave? I don't want to deal with you. Open the door. Open the door. Mommy! Open the door. Mommy, get off! Please! What are you talking about? Why is she screaming at her mom, bruh? She's actually screaming. She's acting like a baby, bro. E She's screaming at him like, thank God that this guy captured this. You, he's so calm and collective. Like, goddamn, bro. Like, if you're in a situation, you got a girl, just know that things can happen, you know? Women are emotional creatures. So if they kind of get bored in your relationship and, you know, some guy randomly kind of get her warm, there's chances of a girl cheating. And, you know, that's life. Shit can happen. And that gonna suck. Yeah, you're gonna feel some type of way, but this guy's keeping it real and this woman she's completely out of control. I don't I don't know oh, yeah. oh, Please get home, please! I haven't please. done anything. Get home now! Okay. I mean I haven't done anything. Murphy, please! Bro, this guy is I'm actually like this guy is so calm. This guy is keeping his cool. He's really emotional intelligent. Like this guy is. If if you ever caught your girl cheating, just do what the guy here does. Just keep it cool. Keep it calm. And don't panic. Because you see, he is keeping his calm. And he is cool. And not reacting towards her, getting angry, frustrated, throwing shit, you know, screaming, hitting, punching her. And now she's completely freaking the fuck out. She's literally screaming at her mom like she's three years old. She's acting like a baby, bro. And she's done the act. Let's keep watching, though. <laughs> I haven't done anything wrong. Why is there no sound? Mom! I saw her talk to another boy. I said, Scroll mommy, up. She scrolled up. She asked another boy to come over that night. The night she was talking to me. Mom, so I said, I'm mom. leaving. She said, Why are you leaving? Mom! Mama! Please! So now she's going crazy because I'm trying to leave. Mom. Please, open the door. I'm trying to leave. I'm not going to push you out of the way. Open the door. Where the fuck is my phone? It's all in your room. How do I know? Go and get it now. I want to see it, bro. Bro, I kind of feel I feel bad for the guy, man. Like, damn, he's he's handling this shit really fucking good, and it sucks to see that some type of some type of shit like this happens. 
But damn. But this woman, she, 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 she got no control in the moment right now, bro. You fucking smashed it, you dickhead. That's a lie? Yes, you did. That's Don't lie. fucking lie. I didn't touch your phone. <laughs> you know, this is what she just did now. What she just said of. I honestly, I can't believe the woman because if you caught her something in, in something, most women will, I'm not, I don't have anything against women, but just in their nature, they will pull things towards you. They will put the blame on you. They will try to find something to get mad at you for to put their frustration on you. You can just see that right now. The woman just called straight up disrespecting him inviting another boy over while she in a relationship with a guy and is calling him a dickhead and a crackhead i don't yeah and that's probably a lie she he probably didn't smash her phone like for real just i can't take any i i can't trust this woman i can't like i i feel like i respect the guy but the woman i i can't really like there's no control. There's just so much around. It just bubbles around. Like, damn, bro. Stop it, mommy! Mom! Smash your phone. Yes! I already cracked. I am, but he fucking smashed my phone yes, and I okay. grabbed me and then threw I grabbed me. you and threw you? I grabbed you and threw you? Yes, you fucking did! You're such a liar! You're gonna Where? fucking deny it! Where did I throw you? You fucking threw me if I were you, asshole! That's a lie. Stop. You know you're not. Oh my god. I'm trying to leave. You're keeping me here. No, bitch. Where the fuck is it's my... It's on your bed. Bro. Bro. If you ever caught... If you ever caught... Get caught your woman doing some dumb shit, just get the fuck out of there. The best thing you can do is just leave. Never talk to her again. Just leave. Have some dignity. Have some respect for yourself and just leave as these guys does. E whatever the way you're gonna react in this type of certain situations, woman is always going to put the blame on you in some type of way of in some type of way. Like I don't have anything against woman, but goddamn, you can just see she's completely in her emotions right now no she's so angry so frustrated and she does know what to do she's desperate she's acting out of anger hatred and there's and he's she's trying to put the blame on him for something that she did and that is not logical at all is this is some bullshit behavior if this happen to you get the fuck out of there asap this is nothing you want to deal with this is completely bullshit i feel bad for a guy and i'm happy for him that he just want to leave and get the fuck out of the door and get the fuck out of her life because that woman she's no good bed Where? it is on your bed no, your phone is on your Please bed I didn't take it off. Yes, you did. did. No, I didn't. Yes, the fuck you did. No, I did not. Let me see your pockets. It is on yes, my bed. Yes, it is. You want to see my pockets? Give it to me. I have a portable if you charger. Have my shit. And there's nothing in there. Then come here. Don't, because let go of my arm. Let go of my arm. Bed. She's keeping me here. No, I am trying to leave. You have my shit. You fucking grab me. Where? Where did I throw it? Bruh, I can't tell you this. I grabbed you where? On my fucking neck. Shut up. On your neck? Where? Shut up. Where? You Look, it's just stupid. I'm not gonna watch more, man. It's just stupid now at this point. What is she trying to gain? This is um, this is this is a behavior you should never tolerate. And this credit to this man, man. Like it probably hurts in a moment, cause cause he had grew some type of feelings for the woman, and that is okay. And she caught and he caught her cheating and inviting another boy over. And that is cheating. And it probably hurts for him in the moment. And, it's pro and honestly, I applaud for him for just leaving and not reacting in any type of way. I honestly don't believe that he hit her, grabbed her, choked her, whatever. You can just see this is... 
yeah this is just so much negative emotion just manifested by the girl in this moment that's been probably been carried on for a long time within her body damn bro sometimes man when you're when you have a gut feeling you're in a toxic relationship just get out of there asap man unless some some of this will happen to you you know this is bullshit for real.